Howdy folks, welcome back to Let's Play Zelda Ocarina of Time. Okay, last time we just got finished in the Lost Woods, and now we're back here with a new song. So let's go ahead and play it for the Forest Elder, see if we can't change his tune. Alright. Let me see if I can remember. Actually, let me look up the song. It's funny because I said I can remember the songs fairly easily. But yet I'm having all sorts of trouble with this one. Okay. There we go. Why am I getting stuttering all of a sudden? I'm getting stuttering, I'm getting frame loss. It might be because I've got Movie Maker going in the background to edit my last video. You know what? I might have to... Yeah. I just turned it off. What a hot beat! Whoa! Yeah! Has this guy ever listened to radio? Hey, what a nice tune. Just like that, my depression is all gone. Something just came over me. Yeah, it's called Musical Magic. You'll see it a lot in this game, buddy. I'm Darunia. The big boss of the Gorons. Yeah, you kind of said your name last time. Is there something you want to ask me about? What? You want the Spiritual Stone of Fire, too? Special Son of Fire, also known as the Goron's Ruby, is our race's hidden treasure. But hold on, I'm not going to give it to you that easily. If you want it so badly, why don't you go destroy the monsters inside of the Denongo's Cavern and prove you're a real man? That way everybody will be happy again. If you do it, I will give you anything you want, even the Spiritual Stone. I have something for you. I'm not really giving you this in return for anything, but take it anyway. If you wear this, even a little fellow like you can pick up pick a bomb flower using A. Goron's bracelet. Now you can pull up bomb flowers. Because as a kid, we can't use regular bombs. We only have to use bomb flowers. Destroy the monsters in Dodonko's cavern and become a real man. Then we can talk about the spiritual stone. Okay. This will be pretty straightforward. Now we can use these. Unfortunately, we can't pick up ones mounted to the walls, but we can pick up ones that are on the ground. So I think the, our total is 99 rupees that we can carry currently. And I did not mean to do that. Accidentally used a uh, Deku Nut. I will say, the controls for Ocarina of Time, if you're not used to them, can feel very awkward. Especially going back and playing them with an N64 controller. Playing them with a Pro controller probably feels a lot better, overall. But, playing it with an N64 controller, even one based on the Hori Pad, which is, in my opinion, the definitive N64 controller. Really... Not easy. Or, at the very least, not comfortable, I should say. Alright. So what you want to do here is you want to pick this up. And you want to throw it. And that was a little bit too far to that side. The fact that none of them thought to do that before is, uh... Doesn't speak much of their intelligence, does it? No. Alright, let's go down and get in there. This is our- this will be our second dungeon. Dodongo's Cavern. Not particularly a favorite dungeon of mine, but not the worst. I think the worst kid dungeon is the one that comes after this, in my personal opinion. Thankfully, there's only really four dungeons you have to go through as a kid. This being one of them. The 
Sidongo's Cavern. Alright. Now you probably should come in here with a uh, Hylian shield, but I didn't buy one. Because I'm pretty sure there's one I can get for free, and I don't remember off the top of my head where. Yes, thank you, Navi. Now watch out for those guys. They'll mess you up. But all you have to do is really bomb them, and then there'll be no problem. And so, we want to go over here, I believe. I'm doing this off of memory. So I'm hoping it doesn't take too long. Ah, here we go. We've got some, uh... Baby Dodongos. And they explode. Dodongos basically being fire lizards. Explosive fire lizards. Just gotta be careful and make sure that I don't take too much damage. Alright, so there's no... I don't have any bomb flowers over here yet. Beautiful. Alright. I actually do need to get out my slingshot. I'll probably need Deku sticks later on. Go ahead and save just to be safe. Alright, this room. Now we got these guys. Lizalfos. Basically... Lizard versions of those big skeletons. Alright, so he'll jump away, and then I think his partner's gonna come to try and mess me up. Come yeah, on. There we go. I love the Z-targeting in this game. I don't care what Ego Raptor says. It is great. Alright, he's down. Come on. Come take your licks, buddy. Yep, that's my bad. Kind of threw me off. Should have paid a little more attention to my surroundings there. Alright, there should be some hearts in here. Uh, maybe fairies? Alright, no fairies. Here we have some regular sized Dodongos, I believe. Yes, we do. Uh, and that's why, ladies and gentlemen, you want a Hylian shield. And I cannot remember for the life of me if there is one in here. I think there is. But I don't... 
I don't remember off the top of my head. But I do want to kill all these Denongos first. Alright, there's one, there's two. And then... I should be golden. Yeah, I need to... I should have looked up before I started recording where the other uh, free Hylian uh, shield is. So we're clear of enemies. What we'll need to do now... Get out our Deku sticks. And go as fast as we can. There we go. And we save the stick. Nice. Okay. Now I don't technically need uh, a Hylian shield from what I remember here. It's just nice to have one. You take less damage if you can avoid it. You can't even really technically use it. in here. This has to be either the map or the compass. I'm thinking it's the map because of its location. Yep. Cool. Alright, um... You know, folks, I am going to be right back. I'm going to try and look up where that, uh, Hylian shield is, so... I'll see you in just a minute. Alright folks, I'm back. So, I just looked it up, and... It's actually in the graveyard, so... I wasn't too far away. I remembered that there was one in the vicinity. I just didn't remember exactly where. But yeah, it is in the graveyard. This is a very useful tip early on if you want to save some money. I haven't visited the graveyard much yet. I believe the one with flowers is what we want. Hey kid, don't mess around with the graves. I'm Dompei the Gravekeeper. My face may be scared, but I'm not a bad guy. Let me give you an adver advertisement for my side business. Dompei the Gravekeeper's heart-pounding grave digging tour. What's gonna come out? What's gonna come out? When I start digging, we'll find out. Alright. Now this should be the right one, I hope. Yay, there it is. You got a Hylian shield. And unfortunately, because we're only a child, we can't fully wield it like an adult, so we just have to duck. Not incredibly useful, but 
it won't burn away. All right. So back to the Dongo's Cavern, we will go. I think once we get a significant portion through there, I'm going to go ahead and end the video as well. But yeah, just if you're if you're going to want to play this game beside me and maybe you were forgetting a few things, that's where you find the free uh, Hylian Shield. Should have went and gotten it way earlier than I did. But it is what it is. So now we still have 99 rupees and shouldn't have to worry about spending any of them. Okay. Yeah, I'm hearing a lot of noise around my house, so I'm going to have to wrap up this recording pretty quickly, otherwise it's going to get pretty noisy. All right. Dodongo's Cavern. You gotta admit, this stuff was pretty scary for a lot of small children who may have played this game. All right. We'll go ahead and... Uh, Okay, that went terrible. There we go. Want to hit that dead center so that way this staircase can fall. But I do believe we want to go in here. Okay. It's a trap! Now, the only way to kill these, unfortunately, is with the bomb flowers. Thankfully, there was only one there. This should be the compass. Yes, sir. I do not remember what the dungeon item actually is here. It might be actual... Is it actual bombs? I'm starting to think it's actual bombs. But I thought Kid Link couldn't use bombs. I don't know. I can't remember. Either way. What? Alright. Another gold sculpture. I remember one of the first times I killed that, I was like, how do you get that? And I couldn't remember that these, or I forgot that these were vines. Okay. That should have killed you. Why didn't that kill you? Okay, there's a couple of them. That's gonna be annoying. Oh, 
That blast didn't do anything. Unfortunately, I think I have to try to kill him with these while they're out. Because the game's weird like this. Grow back, dang it. Oh, this is annoying. And I'm dying. Come on, dude. Oh, that would have been so great if that had hit him. Got him. Alright, that's one of about... half a dozen down. Really, I don't even need to kill them all. I just need to come up here. I just wasted a whole bunch of time, and I apologize. <laughs> oh, boy. Yes, Navi, I know. You'll never know what'll be around a corner. Use Z targeting. Blah 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 blah. Let me play the game. Alright. Thank you. Alright, so what I need is a bomb flower, which we've got right here. This is where the camera starts messing with you. Oh, hey, there are hearts in there. Alright, what's in here? Oh, what a waste. Yeah, time this just right. Okay. We're not doing too bad. We got a little bit of damage, but we're not doing too bad at all. Alright, this is probably timed, but I want to get health. That's what I desperately, desperately need. Yep. Those switches are usually timed, but they don't have a timer sound for whatever weird reason. And that does it for them. We are making progress. Another, uh, Lizalfos room. Alright, gotta really be careful here. 
which that is not doing. Alright, now I need health. I see where it is. Do I go for it? Alright, I let him get way too many hits on me. Right, come on, buddy. There we go. Not bad. Alrighty. Okay, this is where I came from. I wonder if those hearts now nah, they didn't reset. It'd be too easy. Or no, was this the way that I came? This may have been the way that I actually came. Yeah, there's grass down here. Yeah, this is the way I actually came. had me a little bit twisted, but once we get through here, I think we'll go ahead and call it a video. Two of these switches. There's health I could go get down there, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bother. Alright, and this is going to be the dungeon item, which I don't remember off the top of my head what that actually is. And I think it's bombs, but... Yes, it is! You found the bomb bag! His bomb holding bag is made from a Dodongo's stomach. That's a uh, really need-to-know basis fact there, game. 20 bombs inside. So this makes things a lot easier in terms of needing to blow stuff up. Because now you have your own arsenal of bombs instead of relying on the flowers. Beautiful. Alright. So, I'm gonna call it a video here. Thank you very much for watching. And in the next part, we're gonna continue on with the Dongo's Cavern. So, this has been Super Koopa. God bless. Have a good one. Peace.